Hey there, I'm Colin from Barn2, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to use the WooCommerce Lead Time plugin. The WooCommerce Lead Time plugin lets you add custom front end delivery timeframe notices to in stock, out of stock, or back ordered products. For example, if you sell handmade or custom products that take five days to make, you can show that lead time on the product page. Or if a product is out of stock or back ordered, you can display an estimated ship date right on the product page. Publicly displaying your lead times is great for your store because it helps you keep your customers informed and sets proper expectations for when they'll get their orders. Your shoppers don't want to have to guess when they'll receive their orders and WooCommerce lead time lets you give them the information they need to make an informed decision right on the product page. Plus, it means fewer support requests for you because shoppers will never be confused as to why their order hasn't shipped yet. WooCommerce lead time gives you the option to set a global lead time for all your products or customize the lead time for individual products. Or you can do both and set one global lead time and then override it for individual products as needed. Let's get started on the tutorial and I'll show you how it works. Once you install and activate the WooCommerce lead time plugin, you can access its settings by going to the settings link under the WooCommerce section in your WordPress dashboard. Then click on the products tab and then select the lead time option. In this interface, you can make a few key choices. First, you can choose what types of products to display lead times for. You get three options, in stock products, out of stock products, or products on back order. You can enable them all or only choose the product statuses that fit your business. Below that, you can choose the lead time prefix. This is the text that appears immediately before the lead time number on the single product page. That is, your visitors will actually see this text. For example, if you're selling handmade products, you could add a message reminding people that you build each product from scratch. Or if it's about out of stock products, you could add a message explaining that the product is out of stock. Below that, you can use the global lead time box to set a default lead time for all of your products. Remember, you'll always be able to override this for individual products as needed. You can enter both text and numbers, which lets you choose your own quantifier. For example, you could enter five days, five weeks, five months. Or if you have like a restaurant ordering system, you could even go shorter and enter five hours or one hour or even 30 minutes. Finally, the lead time text color lets you choose the color for both the lead time prefix and the lead time number itself. If you want to make sure your customers see it, you can use an attention grabbing color like red. So that's how to configure the plugin's global settings, but WooCommerce lead time also lets you enter customizable lead times on a per product basis. To set this up, Edit the product that you want to add a lead time to and scroll down to the regular WooCommerce product data box. Then go to the inventory tab in that box and there you can enter a custom lead time in the lead time box. You have the same options as the global lead time so you can enter weeks, days, months, hours, minutes, whatever you want. And remember, any value that you enter here will override the global default lead time that you set before. And that's it. You just learned how to set up custom lead times with the WooCommerce lead time plugin. Now, your customers will know exactly when they can expect their orders, which keeps them happy, sets proper expectations, and cuts down on support requests. Get started with WooCommerce lead time today and you'll be up and running in no time. And if you enjoyed this video, let us know in the comments and subscribe to the Barn2 YouTube channel for more great videos on how to get the most from WooCommerce.